Hey guys and welcome to another one of my videos. I'm Michaela, and this is my art channel. Now today I want to show you a very simple way for you to check your consistencies of your paint. Because everything is ready to go, you have your canvas, you have your paint, you have all the tools that you need and you are basically good to go. But a very important thing when you are pouring is that each of your paints have the same consistency because you don't want your paints to run too fast or too slow. So each color have to match. So you are in luck because today I am going to show you a very easy and simple way to test if all your paints have the same consistency. I do it every time I want to do a painting. I just double check that each paint is running in the same pace. So that is what I'm going to show you today. So are you ready? Okay, let's make some magic. Hi guys, I am ready for you to see how I find my right consistency in my paints. Um, I have set up my four colors in front of me. Um, here I have the uh, sky blue from Amsterdam. I have my ocean blue from a Danish retail store called Sustanekaine. I have my gold from Schminke. And last but not least, I have my turquoise blue, also from a Danish brand called Sustanekaine. So these are the paints that I am going to be working on today. And as I told you before, it's a very easy way to check if all your paints have the same consistency, which is something that you would like them to have. So I have this piece of paper, just regular paper. And what I'm going to do is I am going to take one color to begin with and make a drop like this. You don't want there to be too little paint, but also not too much. And you can just stir it a little bit. You take the next color, you place it next to each other, the same amount. And we take our beautiful gold color from Schminke and we place the gold right here and we take our turquoise blue stir it in the cup a little bit and then do the same try to find the same amount now already I can probably tell that my ocean blue is probably more thin than the other colors. So what I do is I just lift my paper and I do this. So you can see the ocean blue is definitely running faster than the other colors. My gold is running the slowest, you can see. I can also see that the four colors are matching each other really nice. Okay, so what I will do is I will just take this aside. I will fold another piece of paper. And I will take my gold and add just a little bit of water a little bit maybe a small teaspoon half a teaspoon okay also I could see that my ocean blue color it was running 
quite fast compared to the other colors. So I think it's basically okay, but what you can do is just add a little bit of more paint and stir the cup. And let's do another check. So let's see, we're gonna do the same once again. I'm gonna take my sky blue from Amsterdam, maybe a little bit more like this. And let's take the ocean blue, the one where I just added a little bit more paint. Let's take our gold where I added a little bit more water. And the last one, our turquoise blue. Maybe a little bit more. It's important that you try to get the same amount of paint on the paper because otherwise it's not gonna run very even. Okay, so one more time, let's lift the paper. See what it says. So here you can see, now this one is running really fast and the other three are going actually very much the same. So what you can do Shall we see? Third one is the charm. Isn't that what they say? Let's add just a teensy, whoops, teensy weensy amount of more paint. So even though I have been pouring for quite a while, um, I need to do this or I don't need to do it some I know that some people don't do this but I find it quite important to do it so let's do it one more time if it still doesn't work <laughs> to perfection at least I hope that I have shown you a good way for you to Check your own consistencies of your paints. You can also use a cardboard or maybe a plastic piece of plastic. Just make sure that every color has the same base. Okay, let's see. Final try. Ugh. Let's see. Let's see how this works. Can you guys see it? Yeah, much better, much, much, much better. So this is the consistency that you want. Some prefer their paints to be a little bit on the thick side. Others like them to be a little more on the thin side. But now you can see that it's actually going very much uh, in the same pace. So this was my trick today. Uh, it's going to help you a lot when you start to, to pour when they have the same texture, same consistency. So if you like this video and if you would like to see more videos from me, you can subscribe to my channel and also you can hit the notification bell so you will know when something new has come for me. Okay guys, well, that's it for now. Have a great day. Bye.